in Lugano. I'm Fabian, this is uh, Serena. We came here to have fun and we made this uh, project. It's not super serious, but um, it's actually a lamp to show other people the dreadful emotions you go through while you are in a meeting. So you use this here, over here, to show the other people uh, how you feel. If you click one of those, the lamp changes its color according to your emotions. So everybody in the office can have a laugh about how shitty you feel in the meeting. This is Giancarlo. My name is David. Look at this. This is a lamp supposed to be placed on a, a side bed, maybe. Uh, so, uh, for several purposes, uh, for, for sure, one is to have uh, some light for reading. Questa si chiude, ci manca. Il polipropilene sopra l'avete già tagliato? No. Allora, tagliamo che larghezza. So, when um, this, uh, the Arduino system is installed inside, we can um, foresee the time, uh, that the uh, wake up time, and then starting some minutes before lighting up, with uh, some nice, uh, nice uh, light. The system can connect via internet, so simply uh, connecting and pushing the proper color, you can see it uh, changing in your line, in your line, black. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's more personal than this. I'm so happy it's only one piece. Yeah. 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 Yeah, hi, I'm Thomas and I built this lab. It talks to my uh, controller field. So depending on the color that's here, the light changes. It works like magic. <laughs> so you can sit on your sofa and change the color of the light. Good. Here is our lamp. Uh, she, she had an idea to, to do the same logo of the Deadly Hallows uh, in, the, in the Harry Potter saga. Inside the circle there is all the electronics doing the real things, like the Arduino Yun and um, AC-DC converter. Um, the plan is to connect it to a train timetable so every time uh, a, a train uh, does a stop, it can uh, change uh, the color of the lights. It's kind of uh, interesting to, to bound the two worlds, the technology and the, uh, the storytelling. Ciao, io mi chiamo Maurizio. La curiosità su questi sistemi di illuminazione ce l'avevo per anche unire un po' il, la possibilità di adeguarsi all'ambiente, quindi ho trovato un sensore che è sensibile al, diciamo, al colore dell'ambiente, alla, 
all'illuminazione dell'ambiente e da quello si può adeguare, quindi magari mappare dentro all'interno una tabella dove i colori esterni si possono far apparire sull'illuminazione con i colori congruenti d'arredo o di illuminazione invece spinta perché magari l'ambiente è scuro, insomma. Are you happy? Yeah! yeah. yeah. <laughs> Però ti sei ridetto un po'. <ride>